Welcome to my channel, my name is Emily and today we're going to be doing my February setup for my bullet journal. So if you don't already know, I do the series once a month where I go through each theme of my bullet journal. And so this month I decided to choose this theme on friends. Um, if you don't know, I've been somewhat participating in the uh, Friends Readathon this month and it's been really fun so I thought, and I've really been enjoying Friends so I thought I'd do the, my theme for February on Friends like even though that like it won't be in February the readathon but I still just was like, oh yeah, I'm really in the mood for Friends so I want to do a theme for it so yeah, I'm really like happy with what I've done and you'll see what I've done in the next couple for the next couple of minutes. For this month, I um, didn't really want to do anything too over the top or dramatic, so I kind of stuck with the similar theme of what I did last month. So, like, I printed off like all the words with the right font and just got a bunch of pictures from the internet and glued them into my bullet journal, and that's what made my theme, as well as doing the borders with the Boshi tape, like. I don't know, it was just, it's something nice about it, it's comforting, it's easy to do, like, in total, I think this spread took me about two, or two to three hours to do if you include all the pencil work, so it didn't actually take me that long to do, like, this entire, like, month, to only took, like, two months, so that's really... Yeah, I thought that was, it was really good to, you know, have those time management things as well, so you're not wasting so much time on doing, like, a bullet journal spread to making it look good. And for me, I feel like these actually look pretty decent. So I pretty much stuck with the similar uh, spreads that I did last month. The only thing I really changed was that I don't do a mood tracker anymore, and that is mainly because... I got the Addy LaRue diary in the Alp Crate box, exclusive box, so I thought I might as well start using it. And I've been recording like my moods in there so I can reflect on it each year. So I won't be doing one of those, but everything else is pretty much the same, as well as the weekly spreads. Yeah, uh, when I get to the weekly spreads, I'll explain that one to you then.
daily spreads. Um, they have changed a little bit, so I'm still doing the square, like the rectangle cubes for each uh, week. Uh, but I did make Saturday and Sunday smaller, so they fit a little bit better in the um, in the space. And they also didn't really need to be too big because I don't do much on weekends other than pretty much work, so it's fun. Uh, I did screw up a bit, so I did get the white out. But um, because I didn't really plan it out properly in my last month, uh, I didn't have I didn't know what to do with this bottom space that I've got. So instead of um, you like doing something random I thought maybe put a um, thing there where I can put upcoming events so like I'm preparing myself for up and coming events for the in the week so I know that they're coming instead of having to always flick through to the next week or the week after so I know exactly what's happening and I can you know get a good idea of what I need what I should expect for the week after what I need to prepare myself so that's what I've decided to put there. I didn't end up gluing a label on it because I had forgotten to, but it's been rectified now, but it's, yeah, just had to wait for a while for the printer to get working again, that's all. So that is what I've done differently with this month's weekly setup.
I hope you do enjoy or you did enjoy this video. Uh, please give it a like, comment, who's your favourite friends character? Mine would have to be Monica because I love food and and I am a bit of a control freak. So that's me. <laughs> anyway, and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, and I post every Saturday and sometimes Tuesdays. So be on the lookout for those videos. Anyway, um, if you enjoy, yeah, do those things. Anyway, that's it for me today and I will see you next time.